controversy over the exact location of the Konza Techno City is yet to be resolved with Machakos and Makweni counties both laying claim to the city. The county of Machakos wants the Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission to help in identifying the exact boundary between the two counties. The county of Makweni, however, insists maps and the laws stipulate that Konza City is indeed in Makweni. Rita Tinina reports on the row over the boundary of what has been dubbed as the continent's Silicon Valley. In Lambert, Konza area, Eric Kyoko makes bricks as a pastime activity. For several years now, he has been working in construction sites and is hopeful that his big break will come through the Konza Techno City. Not too far off from here, Judy Moki was the time away with her nieces at home. She too is hopeful that the Konza Techno City will change lives here. And it is not just long-time residents who are hopeful. Some have moved to the Konza Malili area recently in anticipation of good things to come. Indeed, prospects for the Konza city, which will lie on a 5,000 acre piece of land, have seen the price of land around the proposed city more than triple in the last two years. On the proposed site, seven boreholes have been drilled and a fence put up. The design of the sales pavilion, which will be the first building on what has been dubbed as Kenya's Silicon Valley, has been approved. The Konza Technopolis Development Authority has also secured from the National Environment Management Authority the Strategic Environmental Assessment. Good things take time. We are going to deliver what we, we, we promised to. With the Konza Technopolis Development Authority now preparing for the second phase of the project, a row is simmering between two neighboring counties of Makueni and Machakos, over which county will be home to the city. What is important is to, to start a process of putting things right. All the political representation of uh, that part of land which is Malili, or Konza City and most of the buffer zone, comes from Makueni. It is in Kilome constituency. According to the Makueni governor, all transactions in the purchase of land for the Konza city were done in Makueni. Anukambani Leaders Forum on the 28th of March this year resolved to support the development of the Konza city, which is located in Makueni County. Machako's governor, Alfred Mutua, signed the resolutions. We were in Kitui, and the three governors agreed that uh, uh, Malili is in Makweni. They probably did us their city, Machako city, which we are very proud of, uh, because they knew that Malili was in Makweni. If they knew that's their city, they would have concentrated on that. Machakos and Makweni were initially one district, Machakos District, which was divided by the 1992 Districts and Provinces Act. Constitution of 2010 said that districts which will become counties are the districts of 1992. And that is why, for example, Mwingi never became a county because the boundaries were changed between Kitui and itself, were changed after 1992. A bigger part of it is in Makweni. Actually, three quarters of it is in Makweni. A quarter is in Machakos. In her assertion of Konza's being in Machakos County, Lands Minister Charity Ngilu referred to a 2012 law. There is no law of 2012 at all. And if, if there is any, she should show us, because it means that there are some laws which are not made in Parliament. Machakos County has written to the Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission over the dispute and wants a team set up to look into it. This is the team which will actually pinpoint where the Techno City is. In Makueni, the county lands minister says the map and the 1992 Districts and Provinces Act are on the county's side. Aside from the boundary dispute, the sale of the Malili Ranch, now earmarked for the city, is embroiled in controversy with the Criminal Investigations Department recommending the prosecution of, among others, Machako Senator Johnston Mudama over the sale of the ranch in Konza. But in Makueni, the county government is looking at the bigger picture. Wherever Malili is, 
that county will benefit from some uh, revenue. For the moment, the issues around the Konza Techno City are perhaps more complex than even the technology it seeks to promote. But for many of the residents here, the wait goes on for the big promise that could change their lives.